Step 7. Copy custom kex to extra folder, manually add sound and ethernet kexts using kext utility. Now it's time to use those other files you downloaded earlier. So jump into the folder named post install and open the folder named extra extensions. In a separate finder window, navigate to the extra extensions folder on the root of your drive. In finder you can just type command shift g, type extra slash extensions, and press enter. Now drag all the files from your thumb drive's extensions folder into your hard drive's extensions folder. Enter your password when prompted, and let Finder replace any files that already exist. Finally, navigate back to the post install folder on your thumb drive. Inside, you'll see three files, an app named Kext Utility, and two Kext files named voodoohda.kext and realtechr1000sl.kext. Drag and drop realtechr1000sl.kext onto Kext Utility, Enter your password when prompted, and you'll see a window like this. Once it says done, you can quit Kext Utility, and then this time drag and drop voodoohda.kext onto Kext Utility. Basically, this installs custom audio and ethernet extensions to your system so they'd work as you'd expect. Step 8. Restart and enjoy. Now that you've updated your computer and installed a few extensions customized to your hardware, you're ready to restart your computer, boot directly from your hard drive, and enjoy your new Hackintosh. Congratulations!